Welcome Taurus, welcome to Coral Tree Tarot. I'm trying to get, oh that's going to be a fire reading. How are you Taurus? I hope you are well, wherever you are in the world. This is going to be your general love message for the beginning of January 2022. We're going to see how your person is feeling and thinking. Um, the actions towards you, intentions, and a potential outcome. Taurus, please remember to take only what resonates. And also remember that the energies are fluid. So the roles can be reversed. Now, let's see. Tarot, please show me the energy surrounding Taurus person. How does this person feel about Taurus? What feelings they have for Taurus? What are they thinking about them? About their connection? We've got the tower, we've got the devil, we've got six of cups and the strength. There is Three major arcana here. <clears throat> they are big energies. They take a while. Your person had a an epiphany, maybe about how strongly they are connected with you. Tower Dells, Six of Cups and the Strength. Um, the Six of Cups and the Devil. It's a very strong connection. Perhaps um, Soulmate connection, perhaps soulmate and someone that you've known for a long time. That person, um, Taurus, feels bound to you. Can be high school sweetheart, uni love, six of cups. Something oh, rocked their life. Um, that was a sudden realization that you they are really strongly bound to you, related to you, connected to you. And with the strength, there may be uh, <coughs> ego, um, ego sort of conflict. Page of Swords, to clarify the, the devil, they definitely, if they're not, if you're not with them, Taurus, they're definitely checking on you, 
quite obsessively sort of keeping tabs on you I like that and the six of pentacles and the strength There is intention to um, balance something, make something even. Um, there are two sixes here. Let's see more. Your person is actually no, one more for tower. Yes, yeah, something they lost again in their life. And it made them, they had a connection with someone, I feel, Capricorn. And uh, this didn't work out, the Five of Cups. And that kind of made them realize that your connection is... Uh, that the reason why this didn't work out is because the connection that they have with you is far more stronger on the obsessive, not obsessive, no. not in the best way. I mean, there's this devil, there's some sort of... Um, excessiveness. And the strength. Um, they, they, they won't leave you alone, I have a feeling, with the strength and the devil. Um, and this tower experience was to help them realize that they are so heavily tied to you. Please tell. Please show me... How does this person feel about I see Capricorn Taurus, I'm sorry. <coughs> Perhaps you are dealing with Capricorn, but talking about Taurus. How does this person feel about Taurus? What are the intentions towards Taurus? How do they feel about that? Please. Justice, Nine of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, and Nine of Pentacles. Um, I like the Justice, I like to see the Justice here, Taurus. It's Libra, Scorpio, um, Capricorn, Leo, you might be dealing with. Um, these signs. The reason why I like Libra here, Justice, um, it kind of makes this energy lesser, obsessive and excessive. So your person is really trying, they've been trying hard to make something, make something up to you. There is justice at nine of wands. <coughs> so there is an energy of wanting to make something up make it even um, they see you as someone who's doing very well for themselves with the nine of pentacles and the queen of pentacles someone that um, embodies uh, energies of 
a woman, if you are interested in women, um, that can take care of the home, children, and also run a very successful business or have a successful career. Now, they may want to contact you and um, show you a lot of attention, um, take you out to nice dinner, pay for dinner, basically treat you. Um, I see this strongly with this devil as well, this devil, there is a little bit of in everything here, there's going to be um, an energy of excess. But, look, you may enjoy, why not? I do like the, the justice here. They do have intention to make it up to you. Whatever this was. Maybe this was that someone else. That didn't work out and in the result they they, they experienced shocking moment in their life when they realized that you are the one that got away Taurus Please, Tarot, these spirits, how does this person feel about Taurus? What do they think about Taurus? What are the intentions and steps? They want to make up something to Taurus. They want to make, make it right. They will not stop. Uh, pretty intense energies around here. Maybe first I should show that. They will persevere and they will not leave you alone with this with this strength and with the devil. It tells me that um, they really are not gonna let you go easily. And they will with the justice and strength um, they will put a lot of effort, a lot of energy. They will not give up um, until something is is made even. I'm really picking up that this was this was a clarifying card for the tower. It, they were with someone else. Um, and it didn't work out, and they want to make it up to you. So, yes, they have nice, pure intentions, but this isn't the most beautiful energy. <laughs> Um, I'd like to see between lovers, you know, or between people looking for a connection that can grow and you need to grow something that is built on, you know, honesty. This didn't feel like honesty at all, like, sorry, gotta be, that isn't feeling good. This. But let's see, people, nothing stays the same, people change, people grow, let's hope this person grows too, we've got four of swords and ace of swords, so they are mm, taking a little pause, they will take a pause, you may not hear from them for a while, just to know what to do. <clears throat> I 
think about how to do it, what to do, what to say with the Ace of Swords, how to, how to, um, I don't want to say it, but with the devil present here, I want to say how to sell, just sell themselves well to you, like how to present themselves. Look, we've got the Queen of Pentacles again. Nine of... No, that is quite extraordinary. We have... Queen of Pentacles and Nine of Wands. Sorry, Pentacles. Hmm. I feel you are doing very well for yourself and they see it and they are a little bit like I want my little um, Queen of Pentacles she's doing very well for herself or himself Queen of King um, there is no gender in tarot. There is queen here twice, but it can be a masculine energy as well. But I feel your person has been watching you. I didn't, then they know very well that you have a zest for business. You are an entrepreneur. You take risks. And they like that. You look well, you smell well. They feel my Taurus is gorgeous. I want to team up with them. Hmm. Where is the love? Can't see it. I see pentacles. I see some um energies from the past where is the love i cannot see any cup any passionate um words here i think so taurus just careful who you're dealing with because their intentions to make something right may be very nice but the six of pentacles I'm not sure if you can see it there's just there's justice and six of pentacles their intentions yes they're very nice we like that Justice, Six of Pentacles, make something right, make something fair, make it up to you, but I can't see any love, no cups. Where is the love, Doris? Hmm. Where is the love? If there is a song, look it up. Where is the love? Okay. Please tell me, please spirit. What are this person's intentions towards terror, towards Taurus? Not terror. Please terror. What are these person's intentions? They see my Taurus really, they view them really highly, they um, praise them for their success, because there is success here on your side, Taurus, this is Earth energy, both the Queen of Pentacles and Nine of Pentacles, that's you Taurus, they acknowledge you are a really fantastic 
Um, catch. Where is the laugh, please? Ace of Swords, Prince of Pentacles, the Moon, and Strength again. So I'm going to open a window. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm going to slowly reveal something of the strength and the moon very slowly. Knight of Pentacles, the slowest knight in tarot deck. They will communicate, they will clarify they will express <coughs> excuse me they will <coughs> excuse me they will um define with the ace of swords everything that words can deliver and thoughts and intellect um slowly with the prince Page of Knight of Pentacles, excuse me. They will reveal something. There is something as well that you don't know. Yeah, they are not showing you that they admire you. Okay, Four of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles and Eight of Swords. They are in a head about it all. And they're not showing this to you. Very slowly, they they are determined. I as I, I cannot see cups here. There's just six of cups here. Nothing else. They are determined with this strength. This person has immense levels of energy, willpower. So very slowly with this, just like this person here, slowly revealing herself. Metaphorically, they will slowly communicate, clarify, say something, define maybe your relationship status. <clears throat> but there is one thing that I am going to repeat again. There's only one card with cups here. The only one representing the energies of love. Just say. Um, Taurus. I would like to pull an oracle. This is um, a message for you about energies or situations in your life that you should pay attention to at the beginning of January 2022. Universal love. Sacred destiny, and now also whispers of love. Whispers of love, please give me one message for Taurus about this very unusual reading with very little love in the air. <laughs> Honesty, you can't make that up. Honesty is essential. Speak with love and truth. There is something that you are not aware of. 
There is something. There is someone here that isn't honest about something. You make sure, Taurus, that you speak. Speak with love and truth. Honesty is essential. Um, the moon, of course. Yeah, I feel... I feel you will relate to this very well. I feel you will know what it means to you and the person that you have in mind. Love. Love is everywhere, all, everywhere around you. Um, if someone throws something at you, respond with love um, and they will be absolutely surprised that you didn't engage in conflict. Um, speak love, show love, show kindness, come from that energy and it will come back because this is how it works. This is a lovely energy um, and I feel they have a lot in common, these two oracles, they have a message for you. Um, no matter what you discover, um, come from a good place, um, approach that with with, um, I don't know how to say it, but with a beautiful, loving and, and honest and um, wise heart. We have pleasure. Taurus, there is so much growth, so much green on this card. This oracle talks about you having the time at the beginning of January to having the time and needing to take the opportunity to enjoy the fruits of your labor, enjoy um, because this is also something that it's part of our life. Not only work, not only discovering um, what's happening between you and your person, take time to go out with friends, spend time in nature, relax, replenish your energies, treat yourself pleasure. Love yourself. Love yourself first. Love yourself first, Taurus. Um, and also be honest. Um, because if something doesn't feel right, it's probably not right. Taurus, thank you for watching. If that resonates, give me your thumbs up and drop me a comment um, consider subscribing to my channel stay safe and goodbye for now